Hey everyone, I've got the details on an all new short coming to Cartoon Hangover, and stick around for the end of the episode to see a sneak peek at the season finale of Bravest Warriors, Catbug. Whoa, that was weird. This week at the office was pretty whack, so let's see what went on. You guys, look. That's crazy, right? Cashews in your mouth! You know what? Jelly Kid is just not getting back to me about the party on Friday. I don't get it. Honestly, I think it's not a big deal to ask for bread. We need toast for the jelly jam sandwiches. What's the big deal? Ah! Whoa, that was weird. So today I want to talk to you about an upcoming cartoon hangover short called Our New Electrical Morals. In the previous episode, you briefly met Business Cat, who's actually one of the main characters in the short. He's a cat, and he means business. It's developed from the hilariously awesome Vector Belly Comics by Mike Rosenthal. Mike's gonna be on a future episode this coming March, so leave any questions you have for him in the comments below. We are now featuring the Vector Belly Comics on the Cartoon Hangover blog and Facebook, so head over there to get your fix until the short comes out. Last time, I asked for you guys to call in and tell us what you think Impossible Bear would load inside of the Hologen. Let's see what you guys came up with. I think that for Impossible Bear's Holojohn fantasy, load up a fancy restaurant and have dinner with himself. Hi, I think Impossible Bear would load a dream where Wallow is his butler and he just feeds him all kinds of stuff and buys him everything he ever wanted. Give power stick. If you missed the chance to call in, don't worry because you still can. Call us and tell us what's your favorite Bravest Warrior moment so far. And be sure to tell us why, because we gotta know that too. Your voicemail just might get featured in the next episode. This week, I was introduced to an insanely cool short called Pig Goat Banana Mantis. It's by Dave Cooper and Johnny Ryan. It features a pig, a goat, a banana, and yeah, you guessed it, a mantis. It is so funny and I really want you to check it out, so do that by clicking right here. Next weekend is Emerald City Comic Con in Seattle, and if you're going, be on the lookout for Beth in full cosplay. She's going to be passing out exclusive buttons and stickers, so definitely say hi if you see her. While you're there, don't forget to stop by the Boom Comic Booth to meet some of the Bravest Weird comic creators. Let's see what cool stuff you guys made this week. This is Alan from LA. I think he'd have million gas powered sticks with potato chips riding on unicorns and a bunch of karate things that to hit. Hey, it's Sebastian from Texas. I think Impossible Bear would have a fantasy about a gas-powered tree. Hi, I'm Dickens, and I think that he would probably put a bunch of unicorn on like the strippers. Everyone loves Catbug. The season finale is even named after him. He is hilarious in that episode. I can't wait for you guys to watch it. We're so happy that you guys enjoy the behind the scenes videos because we want to do way more of them. Let us know in the comments what other kind of behind the scenes videos you'd like to see. As always, thank you everyone for watching and your continued support. We love all of our subscribers. Well, that's all the Cartoon Hangover news I've got for you this week. Don't forget about the season finale of Bravest Warriors this Thursday. It's called Catbug and you're gonna love it. You don't believe me? All right, fine, here's a sneak peek. And a sinus irrigator. Sweet! I got this expired lottery ticket and a knife. My mom's got class. Ah! Kappa jumped! Isn't it great? I told you so. So subscribe so you don't miss the season finale. Seriously, you don't want to be the only loser that misses it. Because that would be embarrassing for you, and a little bit for me. So anyways, 